Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today, my room is messy. Let's clean and do chores. Before we get started, please consider liking and subscribing. I was gonna try to do the wide angle lens, but I got, I got intimidated. It's very wide, but I was gonna make a list of the things that I wanna do so that I am organized and have my mind set to what I wanna do. So I'm gonna make a list. Okay, we now have this list. This is a very ambitious list, so I'm gonna try to just do it rapid. Okay, I'm not gonna do it in order. Yes, I am. No, I'm not. Yes, I am. Okay, uh, so first, <laughs> I'm going to uh, take the plants. I'm gonna treat this entire window shelf. This thing, that, this, this thing. I'm gonna treat all of those plants because I am still in the pro, I'm still in the process of going through and treating all of my plants for thrips, and that one hasn't had it yet. Um, well, hasn't had thrips, but also I haven't treated it yet. Also, I don't know if there are thrips because maybe they're hiding. I don't know, but I'm going to move these plants into the bathtub. Starting with this one. Oh, this is a sad, thirsty begonia. Oh no. Oh, oh, it's thirsty. And it has a trap stuck on it. E Okay. To the shower. Also, this monstera is sad. Oh, I don't know why curly and dropping leaves, so we're gonna treat it and water it. Here's a plant you almost never see from me. Look at how it's leaned towards the window. And then that's the rest of it, but most of it is all leaned towards the window. I really like this. I want this to be more prominent in my collection. That'd be nice, right? Ugh. It's a philodendron burl marks, just in case you're wondering. Also, I just realized I have so much mascara on my eyelid. I'm bad at makeup. I also grabbed the trays from there and we will wash it all, all of it. I just, <laughs> I just put this here to flip the camera to go the other way. But look, it's the mirror. See yourself? Uh, whoa. Okay, flipping. Look at this wide angle. Whoa. What's it look, what's it look like? Ah. Okay, while those are drying off, I'm going to treat these. Not treat, I'm going to rinse. Rinse a rinse, a little rinse a rinse a rinse. Can you see what I'm doing? No, you cannot. Down you go. There you go. I was using for this, wasn't I? Also, people said I need to move the toothbrushes out of the way. Moving them so that we don't put pesticide on the toothbrushes. Got the rag back. I'm impatient and want to do this faster, so I'm just gonna treat the plants that are in the shower right now. I should also put systemic in their soil. I'm gonna do that, I'm gonna do that. And 
I know some people last time got angry that I used reused this bottle and that you're supposed to throw it away. I'm sorry, I'm reusing it. There's a different mixture in here now. Anyone who didn't see the last one, this I mixed a different concentrate of something into here and I should have switched the bottles, but I didn't. Sorry, I'll do it. I'll do better next time, I promise. Also, someone said I should wear gloves, but I just wash my hand. Hope I'm not dying. Okay, so while those are drying in the bathtub, look at how empty the shelf looks. So empty, too empty. Uh, I'm going to clean off this shelf because it's a little dirty. Also, you can see the top isn't painted because we found this shelf on the street and painted it. Okay, what am I gonna use to do that? I should get a rag. Okay, just kidding. I decided I'm gonna be an entire adult and I'm going to vacuum the shelf. And so I have my vacuum here and I'm worried I'm gonna knock over plants, but we're gonna do it anyway. Sorry for the noise. Gonna check and see if it did anything. <laughs> Ooh. It's not the cleanest, but it's cleaner than it was. Okay, now I'm gonna wipe it down the drive. I, like forget that vacuums exist sometimes. And they like make make dirt go away. What a concept. Right? What a concept. Cool. So clean. So clean. Oh, this is gonna be so nice. Okay. Um, I want those to be dry, but it's not, it's not time yet. I need, to, I need to go change my laundry. I'm doing all of the productive things all at the same time right now. So I'm gonna go get my laundry. I'm gonna go switch my laundry. Okay, I switched my laundry and I want those plants to be ready. Should I just shake them off and put them back up there? Sure, sure. I'm gonna dry off these saucers. Also, there are so many plants here, but there's only three saucers. So I need to get more saucers. Okay. Now let's shake these guys off. Okay, I just pulled off the old leaves from here and didn't record, but that's what I, that's what I just did from this. On Sarah Delicio set, that was kind of flopping over, so I readjusted the stake. Now it looks a little better. Shake it off a little bit. I'm sure this bogoni will perk back up because it's had water now. It's just kind of floppy. Oh, I need to shake it off. And there's some systemic on here that I should rinse off. Rinsing it off in the shower, carrying the sink. This one too. I really like how that looks. See that, just with those three? Oh. Okay, I might keep that shelf just like that. Just look at how simple and elegant just with those three. Okay, well, I have to figure out a spot to put the begonia. I'll just put the begonia. Mm. The begonia will chill on the floor for right now. And I'll find a spot for it. Okay. Okay, now I need to figure out how to put the micans back up because I've treated all of my window plants recently my like hanging window plants. And this was in a macrame hanger, this beautiful. Is that my kin so pretty? It's so dark, you can barely see it. Uh, yeah, I, <laughs> I treated it and I couldn't figure out how to get it back into the macrame thing and I like almost started crying. Not because of it, I was just like very overwhelmed and spent 15 minutes trying to put it back in and it wouldn't work and I did. It was a stressful time. 
but I'm going to try to do it now. Let's hope I don't cry. Just kidding, I'm not gonna cry. I don't understand. Aha, wait. It's like always twisted, no matter which way I hold it. <sighs> okay, I have it sprawled there. It's so, I should have never taken it out of this thing. I was like, I didn't want the macrame to get wet, but at this point, I, the macrame would have already dried and it would be hanging back up in the window. Okay, okay, okay. Are we doing it? Are we hanging? The dead leaf. <sighs> Mikan's leaves are even prettier in the dying. Okay, is that it? Did I do it? Okay, I think I did it. Now I can finally go back up. Up there. Mm -hmm. That's not a good idea. Pants are too tight for this. They're cute though, look at my pants. Okay, now I'm going to take the second shelf of stuff and bring it. Variegated bro marks, variegated peace lily that is never, never has enough water. Hoya canosa compacta, variegated string of pearls. Extremely top heavy with a little tiny pot, peperomia and or a ghost. I don't need to show you all of them. I'm going to be doing a houseplant tour in the next couple weeks, so just wait for that. I'm going to clean the tub in between... Oh gosh! In between groups. be able to fit more. Okay, I'm gonna grab the next section. Okay, I need to show you guys this plant. <laughs> this is my mother of thousands and it's still growing. Like it's perfectly healthy there, but it's grown all the way up, down, and then back around. Okay. Okay, bringing this Hoya back in. So many plants happening. So many. I need a saucer for this. Mm -hmm. I don't have a place right now. It's gonna go up there. Okay, oh, you can't really see me. Okay, okay. Now I'm gonna take these two shelves. Move this cosmetic stuff. I just have like, Lotion and chapstick and randomly nail polish on that. No, I'm gonna put it on my bed. Okay. Saucers. Okay, now I'm gonna clean off this shelf which has literal piles of dirt on it. Okay, and all of these things that are here are like propagations that I stuck here a long time ago that are just like empty jars. 
of things. Like this is the ficus triangularis and it's just an empty jar and it doesn't need to be taking up space here any longer. So I'm just gonna move all of these away. Like that's a pothos. That is not a good spot for me to put propagations. I should never put propagations there. Okay, this windowsill back here is literally grimy. Like that's wet dirt. It's so gross. I'm so sorry. Please, please don't judge me for the status of my of my windowsill here. I'm gonna try to wipe it down. So I'm gonna do the shelf first. Also, I know I'm shaking this entire thing. That's fine. Oh gosh. Okay, actually while those are, I should be multitasking and, okay, I am multitasking. I'm spraying these down now. My neighbor started leaf blowing, so we're gonna do a silent film for a little bit. I'm losing motivation. I don't want to do anything. <sighs> okay, I can just move the plants out of the shower, right? And move them to the shelves. And then I'll set up the plugs. And then that'll be it. Okay, I can do it. <laughs>
Okay, I'm actually gonna prune back this thing because, I don't know, it's a little too wild for my taste. So I'm gonna cut it there. things. This is not the best way to do this. I don't recommend doing this. I'm just doing it quickly. And then I have this like bottom stump part that I pulled all the leaves off of. I'm just gonna stick it into the soil. How's that look? And then that'll propagate itself. Oh, that's cute. It's the first grandbabies. It's the first ones putting out their first ones. Okay. And all the rest of this is just gonna be compost. But I still have a full plant and all of those things in the bottom, these are all babies. So these will all turn into the size of this. It's wild. Okay, I have this compostable bag and I'm gonna put the scraps into here. Not the twist ties though. I could probably propagate from that piece, but honestly I'm overwhelmed. I have so much of that plant and I have been avoiding chopping that thing back for a long time because I didn't know what I was gonna do with the pieces and I felt obligated to save every single piece of it, but it's already made like 10 more of itself than it needs to. And I need to let it not exist anymore. That's not what I mean. I need to, I need to be okay with throwing away pieces of it and not having to save every single piece. Okay. Boom. Rinse out the shower. Hoya Carnosa Compacta Variegata that got spider mites and mealy bugs and died. And I didn't include it in my Hoya video because I was embarrassed. Sorry! And then this is my Rulia Macoyana that died. Rip. I'm gonna empty out my compost bucket here too. This silver bucket is where I keep plant scraps that I accumulate so I don't throw them away. I just put them in here so this thing is filled with dead leaves. It's probably not good to keep that much dead plant material around so I try to empty it as often as I can. Okay, I don't know how much video this made, but I've been working on this for like two hours and honestly I'm tired and I never accomplish all the things that I want to. I did that whole journal thing and I think I just cleaned these three shelves worth of plants, but I did something productive today and that is all that matters. And if you guys worked along with me cleaning at the same time as me, good job, we did something. And if you didn't, I don't know, it's a, <laughs> Today is a weird day. Um, okay, thank you guys so much for, sorry, 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 I'm in a weird mood. And I'm sorry, I keep apologizing. I'm just tired, it's Friday. I'm shooting this on Friday, spoiler alert. And I am ready for the weekend. But thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you enjoyed, please consider pressing the like button or subscribing down below or both. 
if it's Friday and you're seeing this on a Monday and I feel like that's a, that's a cruel thing to do to you because I know it's not Friday. But for me right now, it's a Friday. <sighs> Subscribe. My channel. Okay. I, I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.